Welcome! In front of me I have Polar Vantage M2 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications uh, from your iPhone on the watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with your iPhone via the Polar uh, Flow application. Once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we can, or rather we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed for the Polar Flow application and your iPhone to send the notifications to your watch. So let's open the settings on our iPhone. In settings, uh, find the Bluetooth option and tap on it. And in the Bluetooth menu, you should see the Polar Vantage M2 on the list of my devices. Tap on the info icon next to it. And here you should see the option called share system notifications. As you can see, in my case, it's not here. If it's the same for you, we need to close the settings, open the Polar, Polar Flow application, tap on more, tap on devices. On this page, you should see Polar uh, Vantage 2. Scroll down and find the phone notifications option, enable it, then go back to the menu and the watch should start syncing with your phone. Once it's done syncing, you should see the pop-up about the permission. As you can see, we need to allow this permission. And now when we go to the settings, Bluetooth, tap on the info icon, the share system notifications option will be here. Make sure this option is enabled, then go back to the main page of settings, scroll down. Oh, my bad. Ay, ay, ay. Let's close this, go back to settings, scroll down. Uh, find the uh, Polar Flow application. Tap on it. And here, make sure that the Bluetooth option is enabled. Once it is, you can close the settings. And we can reopen the app, Polar Flow app. Tap on devices. Make sure that the phone, the phone system notifications are enabled. And you can also change the mode to always on, training on, or training off. Okay. Uh, you may also try to resync the devices again if the notifications are not working to make sure that the settings are applied. So to force sync the devices, simply press and hold the back button, keep holding it, and after a second or two, you will see that the devices are syncing. And after they're done syncing, you should be able uh, to receive the notifications. Now, I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord just to show you that it's working. So let's open the Discord send the message. Uh, well, let's wait until it's done syncing first, and then we're gonna test it. Okay, so we can send the message. As you can see, we have the message on our iPhone and also on our watch. And if we uh, press, I believe, no, not press. Um, maybe it's press and hold, no. I'm not sure how to open the notification menu on this watch. Oh, it's okay, I found it. So you uh, press the button to open the menu, then use the down button right here to scroll down, select notifications and press the middle button to enter. And here we have our notification. Okay. And that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.